What's up, y'all? I'm Mike from Omega Music. We got Stathis. And I'm Sarah Stathis with the Bar Barrel House. And uh, speaking of the Barrel House, congratulations. One year anniversary Thank for Barrel you. House 2.0 just happened. So give them a clap when you're at home watching this. You know Yay, you know? us. Yeah. Uh, thank you. So today we got a, a, a bunch of Black Friday releases that we want to feature. Um, shout out to the homie Lou at Traffic Entertainment for sending us the super duper care package. Um, Big ups. He, he, we had uh, some 45s he sent us from Get On Down Records that we raffled off at the one year anniversary of the night, so that was great. That was ice cream 7 inch I desperately uh, wanted. <laughs> I specifically said that they weren't eligible for Lou, so. Uh, you know. <laughs> Obviously, it's still a little raw, but uh, but yeah, we got a bunch of good shit today, so we're gonna get right into it. Um, also, I want to shout out uh, Papa D and Tall Matt at Get On Down Records. They watch Crack and Seals, and they yeah. send us all that stuff. So, peace to y'all. Really appreciate it. Uh, first up from Get On Down, we've got the <clears throat> probably the thing that That's maybe you're most looking forward to on uh, Record Store Day. Yeah, Zarface presents Dog Days of Tomorrow, which is Zarface collaboration with Ghostface, which is a long overdue, right. no-brainer collaboration. So it's a comic book, it's a 45, it's dope. We're gonna crack that open. Mm -hmm. Then we've got uh, the, this is like the one I'm most uh, intrigued about that I'm, I'm not familiar with. This is the LeBron Brothers what? Orchestra. Psychedelic Goes Latin. This yeah. is also on Get On Down Records. Um, at the time, it was described in like the late 60s as the, mo the weirdest music ever cut in the Latin dance genre. Hmm. So if you like to get weird on the dance floor, which why wouldn't you? Right. <laughs> this is what you want right here. Um, then we got a couple from uh, Crack and Seals uh, alumni mm -hmm. here. David Axelrod with Earth Rock. Earth Rock. Yep, yeah, this is the third in the Capital David Axelrod trilogy that it's we've uh, covered previously. Yeah. The album is about a musical comment on the state of the yeah. environment, so what a more fitting time. Sure. Yeah, uh, to yeah, reissue yeah, yeah. this record, it's uh, my favorite in the trilogy. It's such a good record; you gotta have it. Um, and Black Friday, it'll be out. And then, bonus David Axelrod. Mm -hmm. This is David Axelrod's collaboration uh, with his son Michael Axelrod. It's called Pride, and um, this one is more like a psych pop. Okay. Uh, with like a little bit of folk in there too. So mm -hmm. uh, kind of a, a different than what you'd expect from David Axelrod, but. Uh, I'm sure it's amazing. I haven't heard this one yet, so I'm super, super intrigued about this one as well. Yeah, yeah. Um, so yeah, we got all kinds of goodies. Um, there's obviously like hundreds of other records coming out or that we're going to have for sale that day. The list is insane, yeah. too. Like, I admittedly, unfair. I haven't looked at it yet. It's, uh, it's almost like, I haven't had time. I thought about not looking at it on purpose because it's yeah. just like you just, the dollar signs just right. come back and you're like, oh, <laughs> yep, I gotta get that, I gotta get that. But um, we wanted to feature today some of the stuff, you know, everybody is looking forward to like Grateful Dead and all that, and that's good. Those are great records too, but we wanted to feature some of the kind of more, maybe under the radar stuff that is- the deep cuts. Yeah, the essential pickups yeah. for your collection. So uh, again, make sure you stop down at Omega Music and grab some of these. What are we pairing with today? 50 West punch you in the IPA. Oh man. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Killer Brewery out in Cincinnati. Ice cold. Oh yeah. So, double dry yeah, hop. Double dry hop, 9.2% Imperial IPA. It is one of my favorites from 50 US and available in cans. I'm going to give you a awesome. tutorial on how to not pour a beer. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Just that we got to do a close up. So, <laughs> boom. I just want to see the Cooley method in action. It's working. He's doing it. Oh, yep. Wait, we I got some dribbles. So. See, that's how it always happens with the dribbles. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Can I get the whole? Uh, no. Nope. Up. Uh, nope. Up. Uh, uh. Nope. That's not how you do it, folks. That coolly <laughs> method strikes again. See that? That's how you do it, right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh oh man. man. Messy. <laughs> All good. All right. Wait. Well, hey, cheers, y'all. Cheers. Cheers. Even the foam tastes good in this one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's big, man. It's pretty. It's got a lot of those tropical fruits going yeah, on. Definitely some maltiness. Mm-hmm. Yeah. For sure. How many more episodes till I can pour a beer? I'm not sure it'll that, ever happen. Yeah, ever. that's a you question. Damn. Maybe okay. nitro. If we did a nitro can. Yeah. Oh, we, we need to do nitro. <laughs> 
Then I look like a G. I'm yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. I mean, I don't think you just turn it upside down and be fine. Nothing yeah. happened. No. Uh -huh. yeah. I have a feeling that like the camera slip, land in the glass or something. <laughs> something I thought that was some kind of way. But uh, but yeah, make sure you stop at the Barrel House, get some of this 50 West, uh, punch you in the IPA, which is a sweet name. Right. Right after you uh, hit Omega on Black Friday, mm -hmm. pick up some vinyl. Are y'all uh, y'all having any kind of open turntables on? Friday. I mean, we always we have one open that. turntable with okay. headphones. Um, yeah, that's true. Right? It, we sits, it sits right here. We right haven't really planned on doing anything special for Black Friday because okay. Small Business Saturday is more our day. Right, 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 right. right. Um, which is the following day. Yeah. Well, tell them about Small Business Saturday. What do you got going on Small Business Saturday? Nothing super special other than being <laughs> open. <laughs> yeah. Well, so here, here it is. Here's the thing. Our one year anniversary was past that. Was past that. Right, so, so we're kind was, of recovering from right, that. Right, right, right. Um, but we will have um, a local coffee roaster doing free coffee out on the patio, um, eleven to four, okay. and selling his beans. He brews, or roasts them himself. So okay. that's kind of Troy, cool. one of the nicest dudes you'll yeah. ever meet in your entire yeah, life. Good yeah, good dude. Good coffee. So we'll have free coffee. Sweet. Awesome stuff on tap as always. As always. Yeah. As always. Awesome. Yeah. We got a bunch of stuff going on Small Business Saturday, too. Uh, we have uh, our gift card sale going on on Black Friday, so if you're looking to get a gift for somebody, um, that's like the absolute best time to do it. Um, get a $100 gift card for 80 bucks. Hello. Damn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plus, we have a turntable sale going on. That's free money. That's literally yeah. free money. Yep. And uh, we're doing a, a coat drive all weekend long, so on Black Friday, Small Business Saturday, and the Sunday after that, bring in a coat for St. Vincent de Paul. We're trying to reach the goal of 200 coats. I think we did 150 last year, so we're trying to get 50 more this year. I'm sure oh, we yeah. can love this um, yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Seriously. Bring them down, and um, you'll get a spin on our prize wheel uh, for bringing a coat, which uh, there's usually free beer on the prize wheel, keeping it. I love free know, beer. Yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> come through. And uh, thanks for tuning in to another episode of Cracking Seals. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers.